Please join us as we shed some new light on our RV situation. It's our blessed adventure. It's our blessed adventure. So my wife wasn't all that crazy about this light here. So I even tried. She tried to put some shells on, shells on it. it to make it still not happening. It. So today it's time to upgrade the light. So we got the chief electrician here, and so we're going to get started. Shout out to our brother-in-law. <laughs> so we're going to get started, and we're going to cut this light out and get started with the new one. And we have Supervisor DJ and Supervisor Gary. All right, get ready to cut the wires. DJ. All right, so now the wires are out. So we're going to have to get these wires figured out here, which one is our positive and which one is our negative. So we're going to get the tester. So got these two wires we figured out. They were coming from the same loom, and we got this one's coming from the same loom. So, we're gonna get the tester up. Let's, uh, let's do it this way. All right, let's get the power turned on here. You ready? Power's on. Turn we're gonna on. turn the power on here, and we're gonna get the testers working here. Go so, red there. Red there. Right there. All right, we're coming down, and we're showing 12, 8. Positive and or negative? It's showing a negative 12, 8. So we know we need to probably is just the opposite flip these around. So we'll flip around. We'll put the leads on the different ones. We'll come down. And now we have a good 12, 8. So, so now we have figured out which one's positive, which one's one's positive and which one's negative. All right, so, so that'll be your positive. We got that figured out. That the one closest to us over here is positive. All right, so get this thing prepared here. Got our wire nuts. Wait, hold it. Wait to get that. Got our wire nuts. Get this up here. Oh, let's get the power turned off. Turn the power back on. Turn the power off. Practice safety here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. This is part of the new light. So. I hope I'm going to be 100% happy with it. I was scared when they cut the wires. That was your positive. Yep. So positive. Going to this is going to be that instead. So I'll get the that twisted on. Wires, make sure they're good. All right, we'll get this other one hooked up. Make sure the ends of your wires are at the same point. Make sure the wires are good. Good test. All right, now we're going to flip the power on and see what we get. Look at that. Oh, there's light. Look at well, we have light for one. Light. one of them, the other one ain't working. Why the other one is not uh -oh. working? Huh, interesting. Maybe it's the light bulb. Let's double check. Well, Let's make sure be. that the light bulb is just not bad. Let's take this light bulb out. That hurts in the... Here, let's just move this other one over. Just to see. Alright, so flip the power on. Oh, we noticed the light bulb, so we got another light bulb here. We'll turn this one off for a second. Oh, I got that common bulb in my Looks like the common bulb, you say, Gary? Looks like it. It is. Alright. So there's the bulb. Let's see if we can find another bulb. Well, we figured out that the socket does work but we don't have any more bulbs. So we'll have to get some more 12, uh, 12 volt bulbs and then, uh, then we can put it in. So we're just gonna get it fastened up and get the rest of it. We don't need that part. We got this one here. So and if you do think about a new light, you do have to make sure you measure 
so that your cabinets open up and you have, yes, and you have enough room. So, so it doesn't hit. We're going to mount that right at the edge. lined up with the center. We're going to go right at the edge of this. Right there? No, nope, no, nope, right at the edge, edge of that. that. Right there. So is Which that... way you turn? No matter which screws. Make, yeah, it doesn't make a difference okay. to me. What is that center, honey? You have, to, you have to look at that, whether it's center on this. Center on, in like in between the middle? Over your what table? Do you think, supervisor? I think so. Not in the right position. I'd say go that way, just the, that way. Cool. The question is, do you want this turn, or how do you want your bulbs pointing to? Yeah. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> you want your bulbs sideways, yes. front, and back? Okay. Like that. All right. So. Yes. Longer screw. Longer screw. <laughs> All right. Take four for use, use that to uh, measure that. It's kind of centered. There we go. All right, hurry, hurry. I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> when you get older, it takes a while to do stuff like this on up your arms. Did they have to drill a new hole in the ceiling? Are y'all still? <laughs> Make sure you're still center. I mean, because we can pivot it. Yeah, so that one in. Yeah, that's pretty good. Happy and you know it. Go over back that way just a hair. Right, uh, oh, not too much. Are we screwing into the ceiling? Right there. New yep. holes? Yes. Or the same holes? New holes. Oh, no. Ooh, that's scary. Oh, you got it. I think the light. <laughs> going to the water. I think they're getting tired of me in this life. Keep going until you see water. <laughs> <laughs> oh, keep going until you oh, see water. Oh, look at that. Do they give me three screws? Just two. Well, three, three would have been better. I could put more in there. Yeah. yeah. Well, it'd be pretty pretty solid. Like you got you're bouncing heat. down the you road in Alaska. Roads are like going down the road. Well, that's why I thought about actually putting two more in there. Because the globe is supervisor says right. another square. The globe is gonna be on there. So I should probably pre-drill. I don't have to. And you got self Move that center thing a little bit, but the globe will be inside now. So, 
tell me. Let me get on this other side over here. new look and then we have plenty of room to clear the craft cabinets. One, one bulb working on each side. Got one bulb on each side. And then what we're gonna do eventually after we get the other bulbs is we're gonna put some of these shells in the side of the globe and so you'll see shells inside. So we'll probably get back with you to show you what the finished product looks like. So, thanks to all my help. You're welcome. Thank you, Glenn. <laughs> I don't think it's going to give you a lot of light. It's just two small bulbs. Plus so that's what it looks like with one bulb. We have to get another bulb, but that's what it looks like up. I hope it gives a little bit more light. I don't know. We'll see. It's our blessed adventure. It's our blessed. That just shows you, just with a little ingenuity and a little help, you can do some interior upgrades. So I hope you like this interior upgrade to our RV, and I'll share it with your friends. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please push that subscribe button and hit the bell notification so you can be notified when we post uh, all future videos. Thanks for going along with Noel's Blessed Adventures, and thanks for helping us add a little light.